Oh no, is this a cane game? Oh, okay. <laughs> when you get a starter encounter, um, you get scared of the cane encounter where the game ends on 5 4. Looks like this one is um, the same thing as Future Side from before, except you don't get the Zephyr. I mean, knowing who you're going to play against next actually lets you make a lot of good decisions. Because sometimes if you're trying to keep up a loose streak or a win streak, it lets you uh, change your board based on how you want to position and all that other stuff too. Board in front line. Pick up some backliners, two sniper. Okay, I know these guys are from two different classes, but they look very similar. Or like two different origins. Exalted, Cholgath, Jax, Lux, Aphelios, Diana, Silas. Kog'Maw reroll. I mean, when you hit a bunch of Kog'Maws for free, maybe you should play it. I guess I'll find out, see if I'll play it or not. The thing is, Kog'Maw, you need blue buff. Otherwise, like, everything else, like, just damage items. But blue buff is a, is a must-have. Sticks and stones, one, two, three. Healing orbs. Not sick and stones. You just played Yone if you have this, I think. Healing orbs. And it's okay. Only two bench slots. Gain three components. This seems pretty good. Because if I'm gonna. Play Kogma reroll. Okay, actually, I'm pretty sure someone else is going for it. Let's go for this. Jack's pair. This pair. I hit another Kogma. <laughs> I mean, I leveled though. I'm not playing Kogma reroll. I saw somebody with um, Kog'Maw's already, which I'm not going to contest Kog'Maw reroll. And they have a gold augment as well, an augment that gives them the gold. So I'll just play something else. Because this looks like they're already committed to Kog'Maw something. Um, as for myself, I have AP items right now. I don't know if I'm going to slam anything yet. Just have to wait and see what I hit. For the past five something games, aside from the Yone game I played, I always get dropped rod early. The game really wants me to play AP. Because when you get rod, your only options for AD, Crown Guard, and Rage Blade. Maybe Gunblade, but for the most part, you're not building Gunblade on AD champions. Heavenly Altruist. Okay, I'm not playing... I'm not playing this. I'm just gonna chill. Make 20 gold. Pretty bad opener, to be honest. Um, I don't know if I should take a 1, 2, 3. Maybe the other component one was correct. Right here, I mean, I have 20 gold, though. Um, also, switching Kog'Maw here would be good, 
but I want to make sure I lose this round. Although I don't think I was going to win this round anyway. I'm going to pick this up. I'm going to go for tier because I have AP items, so I might as well just play around AP. I know that AP is not really that good right now, but unless you hit Hawaii or something. Hawaii or Azir, but those are 5 costs. Um, AP carries are these guys here. Syndra. I just play around them. I need a better front line. These guys have been paired this whole time. Oh, I guess that's my fault because I leveled. It makes sense. Let me see. I guess I'm just gonna fight a lost streak here. Maybe I can try playing um, Vertical Arcan Arcanist, because I have... I kind of wanted to try it. When you play Vertical Arcanist, you basically just play, uh, obviously, the Arcanist. But um, you just keep your team pretty good with AP. I'm giving up on these two. <laughs> but yeah, Vertical Arcanist. Um, Lux, Zoe. So you can either play Lux carry, Zoe carry, Syndra carry if you hit Syndra 2. I think 6 Arcanist is pretty good, even without Emblem. If you hit the board for it. You either just play one, like, you, you play Zoe. Zoe, um, Lux or Sandra Carry. Just depends on which one you hit. Okay, 5 Lost Streak. Arcanist. Drop this guy. Tear, thrash. Yeah, these are definitely AP items. Let's also hope I don't lose this fight. I right, head out of Mubu. Die. <laughs> okay, whatever. Don't worry about it. Just gonna move on. Not a big deal. So let's see, drop this guy, play this, maybe just a random backliner, this. Spark. I 
Let me see what my next augment is, and then I'll um, probably next turn I'll roll a little bit. Stabilize at 6. Then just move on to level 7. Slow roll. That's my game plan. I'm just trying out Arcanist right now. Shock treatment, stationary. I don't think I need Shiv. Keepers. Not little buddies, I'm playing reroll. Let's go for stationary. Virtue. Or just third row it. Actually, I'm just gonna go straight to level 7. I'm not going to roll here. Go. Yeah, this just looks like um, Arcanists. Let's find out uh, which which Arcanist I'm gonna carry. Lux, Zoe, or Syndra. Depends on which one I hit. Probably four Arcanists drop baited. Okay, let's go for this right now. Also play something else. This maybe. Fighting the 100 HP. Definitely gonna play the Kha'Zix position a little bit better. Maybe like this. Oh, they sold it. I mean, their board is really strong, I'm not gonna win this anyway. I'm lucky, I can maybe kill one more. Okay, three gonna loss. Okay, also I'm gonna go for sword so I can make a Shojin. Pretty pretty rough game so far. I kinda trolled during Krugs as well. But it's fine. Sword got taken. I can go for Rod. If I don't make Shojin, I can go for Adoptive Helm. I can also make Blue Buff. But Blue Buff is only going to Syndra. I know Zoe doesn't really use Blue Buff that well. Um, Lux doesn't either. The Syndra can use Blue Buff. I guess uh, it just depends on what my next components are after Wolves. Play a random Annie on the board. So Soraka can be API and Wilder right now. Um, not gonna play her on my endgame board, but this is gonna be a vertical Arcanist. I think the important part about Arcanist though, you have to hit Lissandra, which can be kinda hard to do. If I win this round, I'm gonna sell the Soraka. Make 50 gold, and then start slow rolling. Okay, 
Let's see. Next encounter. Eight for your rules. Okay, this is exactly what I'm looking for. Syndra. That's actually pretty big. I have a Syndra pair, so I could probably just play Syndra carry. Because I also have a blue buff. She uses blue buff pretty well. So, let's go for Syndra. I didn't see a single Zoe in my rolldown either. Let's also sell this. Guarantee you make 40 gold. So I just have to find one Zoe. Then I can play 6 Arcanist. That's just gonna be my board on 7. I'm gonna roll. And then... Yeah. Stabilize my board a little bit. Playing against Yone. As long as he doesn't randomly kill Cinder, I think I'm fine. Okay, he's dead. Nice. Yeah, my board's looking fine now. Find one Cinder, my board's good. One Zoe as well. Um, Virtue of Martyr makes up for a lack of frontline as well. I think a problem with Arcanist is obviously you don't have that much frontline. But if you have something like Stationary with a Virtue, it's pretty good. These are pretty good items. I guess I could go for Gunblade. So I'm not going to use the sword anymore. Um, Sapphire, maybe. Mo2. Thank you. Oh, huge. I need to find one Zoe. Okay, perfect. This is really good. Okay, those rolls, yeah, really spiked my board. I can go for a Lowey 3. Um, yeah, a Lowey 3. A Mova 3. Slow roll a little bit. If I get offered Arcanist Emblem, I'm just gonna go level 8. And then roll for Lissandra. Let's see if I get an Arcanist spatter thing. LDP teaming up. I don't need teaming up anymore. Best friends actually not even that bad either. Reinforcement. No, thank you. Since I'm playing Arcanist though, I kind of want to try uh, LDP. Joel Lotus, I already have JG. Let's go for LDP. I need to slow rolling. Jax, <laughs> one star Lilia. I think I'm fine this round. I have a two star Syndra, six Arganist. Triple item. With LDP. I guess if I level, I just play Faded. Just play like Sets or Thresh or whatever. Any Faded champion. Make Syndra do a little more damage. Right now, I'm just gonna keep on slow rolling on 7, because I want to find these 3 costs. But by stage 5, I should be level 8, so... Shouldn't stay level 7 for too long. Two lesser duplicators. I'm gonna take the two lesser duplicators.
nothing. No, I'm chill. After this, um, yeah, go to wait. Just play faded. Value is three. This person spent all their gold. Probably not gonna win this fight because it's like Galio two. That's a two. If I had a Mumu three, I'd probably win this. Yeah, my front line got run over. Chain, stone plates. Spat. Yeah. Okay. I mean, I could take spat for faded, but I don't have a rod. If I had faded, I'd probably just put it on Malawi or something, but I'm just chill with this or no. items over. Um, I guess I'm not going for a move with three anymore. Because there's a lobby three. All right, you come back up. Go for uh faded. Lowey 3 with 6 Arcanist and LDP seems pretty good. Actually, let me see. I mean, Lowey was still pretty tanky, so I guess I'll keep the items on her for right now. Um, Fighting Kindred. You only 3. Normally I'd be worried, but I have a, uh, I have LDP. Sentra's a little tankier, and she has healing. I think I think positioning like this is fine. It's only one item Malawi, but Gunblade and Arcanist. Yeah. All right, cool. This must be annoying. <laughs> All right, let me see what my my items are. Kaisa Galio. I'm not sure if this combo is good just because these two champions are good, or because other comps can't keep up. I think it's just because other comps can't keep up. I actually don't even think Galio and Kaisa are that good. It's just that the other four comps are just even worse. No remover. Adaptive home or declaw? Probably declaw because she's three star. She already has healing, so yeah, declaw. I was thinking BT maybe, but she already heals herself. And also, I have gunblade. I actually don't even think I need to move spark over. I'll just wait for the carousel. This is a move too. Kind of want to keep it. It's 
don't play value is really good. Nice. Level next turn. Let's play around him, Yasuo. Trade bot. I think Vertical Arcanist is a comp you can fall back to if you just really don't know what to play and you kind of want to turn your brain off. Death Blade and a Death Cap. Well, the Death Blade is useless, but Death Cap's pretty good. Since it lasts three rounds, one, two, three. Death Cap on Alawi. I mean. It gives Syndra even more AP because of LTP. Um, here, wait, I don't know. Here, have a death blade. Syndra has three hundred percent AD. All right, not AD, AP. Salawi 1460 shield. I think Riot has to be a little careful with AP scaling on Alawi because she's an Arcanist. Okay, yeah, keep on econing until I lose a round, then I'll roll for a move with three. If I find um if I find What's, what's her name? Lissandra, a replacer. Probably just how Lux. I don't think I need Lux anymore. Zoe's just like, she's, she's fine. Nah, I just, I'd rather make 30. I mean, I don't think playing the best faded I can play is set, but it's only if I find him. Salawi is extremely tanky. And she just keeps on healing back up. Okay, streaking. I have to remind myself that I lost the Krugs earlier, so... Um, even though I think I'm doing well now, I'm actually not. Because that image is still in my head. One item here, probably Redemption, Mormogs. Mormogs seems pretty good. So I have Declaw. Declaw works really well with Mormogs and Stone Plate as well. Once the Death Cap expires, then I'll just put it on, Al on Alawi. So the Death Cap lasts one more turn. Do we need to roll here? Probably. Oh, nice. I found it. Guess I could go for Zoe 3. I, I, I don't think it really makes a difference. Uh, I was trying to find a move with 3 or something, but uh, I'll just keep a little bit of gold right now. I don't think I'm going to win this, because... 3 star Thrush, 3 star Velios, Rage Blade. Unless Alawi is just really that tanky with Arcanist. Maybe I'm getting away with this because of LDP, but... Um, I don't know, this seems kind of good. Pretty close fight. Actually, I don't care about Zoe 3. Do I need a roll? Yeah, probably. Moo. It's not a pair. Okay, I'm hoping I win this round because I don't wanna I kinda wanna make tangled here. Um and the 
I haven't really moved my units this whole game. Alright, whatever. Let me see stage 6 if I hit him with 3. I'll have a third item for him as well. I think I'm just gonna continue to LDP um, Alawi, even if I hit their sword Mumu, just because I think Alawi's tankier than a Mumu. There goes my there goes my my Syndra. Can Alawi solo? Cast. I'm, I'm surprised Alawi solo that. But oh, with LDP, she has a lot of stats. I need to learn how to position against Kaiser. I guess you don't want to position like that. You want to position the same side as her. And I don't know. Is that is that correct? Like you want to position like this maybe against Kaiser. Still learning some positioning against some units. Tank item. All right, so yeah, I'm gonna LDP her and just keep it like this. Roll for a move three. Hit a cylinder two. Unfortunately, it didn't combine, but it'll combine next round. Any items now? Just go on the cylinder. Blade. Still streaking. Eight win streak. Mumu. Okay, there it is. Nice. Okay. This is my board now. Um I have all my upgrades, so now it's just going nine. Find sets. And just play a heavenly champion, I guess. Like five cost splash units. Wukong. Set. This Yasuo is the most biggest trade bot in the entire world. Always kind of taking a beating right now, but uh, okay, she's still alive. Yes. I'm pretty sure this is just a positioning diff. That was really close. So the position against the same Zendra, maybe, maybe this positioning would have been better. Maybe something like this. Kinda want Alawi to get targeted, so let's maybe position like this. False don't play value. I should swap other side, but it's too late with LDP. In the previous fight, the Kaisa just targeted the Syndra. I have to watch this again. Let me just make sure. Also, wait, they trapped their Syndra. I mean their uh, Kaisa. Wait, this is actually really good for me, because Rekaisa's not doing anything. Yeah, don't don't trap your your backliners like that. Also, they're level 10. Maybe they trapped it on purpose to beat the other player? I don't know if that was intended. Play Kale if I take this, but I have to go level 9 for that. I think I'm just gonna take 
stuff that's hard. Like, if I was level 9, I would take this. But I can't. Okay, goodbye, Yasuo. Your services are no longer needed. I think I'll just reforge this. I mean, let's our cast faster. Alright, I'll just position like this. I kind of want to see what it's like. Fighting a ghost, though, I can't really gauge how strong it is. Always being targeted by a lot of units. Okay, nice. Let's all cast it again. This, I mean, Lawi's still alive. It's looking okay. Virtue of Martyr still here. I think I'm fine this fight. The other Arcanist player is dead. I mean, I'll take a top two here. Especially considering how I lost the Krogs. So, yeah. Position opposite side, right? Only downside about LDP is you have to position pretty awkwardly. Or like, you have to move so many units at once if you're trying to position your board. Alright, this time let's see if Kaisa targets the Syndra. Training dummy is about to die. Okay, Lawi is still alive, but Mumu is about to die. This looks much better, although Galio is still alive. Tendra. Okay. Can you solo again? It looks like it. Pretty close. Start Udyr. I'm scared of this board because they have so many legendaries upgraded. Um, if I if I don't win this, it's fine. I'm still, I'm still okay because they're, they're level ten. It makes sense that they win. But let's uh let's see. Have level level here, level nine. Ghostly, does that really change anything? Heal two percent max health every two seconds. Actually, that helps uh, Lawi a little bit. Death cap. Should help kill something. Okay, let's find out. The ricochets. Uh, I don't think it'll allow solos this time. Unless maybe she's just not broken in this setup. LDP. No. Okay, one more chance. Double Asandra, maybe. The thing is, they're level 10, so I mean. Yeah. I, I, like, they have too many units, and Sandra's a little bit too slow. I, I think it's just fire RNG. I guess I'll find out. After this, okay. Uh, yeah, double cylinder maybe.
Moment of truth. Yeah, I'm pretty sure this is bad positioning because Kaisa just hit the Syndra. But I mean, I guess she's healing back up. Maybe double Sandra makes a difference. It looks like this fight's a lot better. I don't really know what changed between the last fight and this one, but... Okay, first place. GG. So I lost to Krugs. I didn't really have a game plan early game. Then I just played Vertical Arcanists. It worked out. GG.